Good morning, Cold Spring Harbor. I'm Danny Moore. And I'm Dean Carr Four. Today is Friday, January 20th, and it's a day five. Please stand for the pledge. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Please be seated. Today is Fun Friday. The Hawk Talk News team asked faculty and staff members around the building for two truths and a lie. Today we will see Senora Fristensky's answers. This is not an email competition, just for fun. See if you can guess which are her truths and what is a lie. Take Good morning, everyone. This is Senora Fristensky, a.k.a. La Tigresa. I'm here to tell you about two truths and a lie. Let me see. The first thing I want to tell you is that I am a very avid runner. I run all the time, and I love it so, so much. It's so good to be in shape. The second thing I want to tell you is that for when I first graduated college, I interviewed with the CIA for over nine months. They even flew with me when I went down to Uruguay to visit my best friend. The third thing I want to tell you is that my brother and I, when I was in high school, we used to box together all the time in the basement, and we used to get in trouble from our parents. And now with Senora Fristensky's Fun Friday, Two Truths and a Lie. Think you know which is the lie? We will reveal the answers at the end of the broadcast. And now for today's announcements. Congrats to everyone who auditioned for the junior high production of Bye Bye Birdie. The, class, the cast list will go up today. The high school dodgeball night is next Wednesday, January 25th from 6.30 to 9.30. Side permission slips and $10 from each team member must be submitted to Senor Segura, Mr. Fallon, or a student government representative by today. The pre-order forms for the school store of Patagonia must be returned to Ms. Connolly by next Wednesday with a check for the appropriate amount. If you still need an order form, they are available at the school store from Ms. Connolly. The Junior High Mock Trial Club will, be, will meet on Tuesday at 2.30 and J29. Members are reminded to bring their trial packets. And now to Nikki and Liam with your Seahawks sports update. Good morning, everybody. I'm Nikki Malolo. And I'm Liam Golden. And this is your Seahawks sports update. Today's away games are JV Boys Basketball at Lucas Valley at 4 o'clock, Varsity Boys Basketball also at Lucas Valley at 5.45, and Varsity Ice Hockey at Massapequa at the Dix Hills Rink at 6.40. Tomorrow, the wrestling team will be competing in the battle at Harbor all day starting at 8 a.m. in the Fieldhouse. Um, on, on Sunday, Varsity Ice Hockey has a game versus Massapequa, versus Massapequa at Ice Works at 7 p.m. The CSH competition cheerleading team will comp compete at Wood Whitman High School at 2 p.m. Come support everybody. Go Seahawks! We also want to wish Mr. Sinamo a very happy birthday. Happy birthday. Happy birthday, Mr. Sinamo. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday. <laughs> Thanks, Nikki and Liam. Today is Inauguration Day. In one of the, his first gestures, the incoming president tweeted at 7.31 a.m., It all begins today. I will see you at 11 a.m. for the swearing-in. At 8.30 a.m., Trump and his wife, Millennia, will attend a prayer service at St. John's Episcopal Church, known as the Church of Presidents. Despite a forecast of rain, as of many as 900,000 people, including thousands of protesters, are expected to witness the handover of power from eight years of Democratic rule to a Republican president. After the swearing-in and the ritual drive down Pennsylvania Avenue from the Capitol to the White House, the Trumps will settle in to observe the inaugural parade that passes in front of their new residence. And now it's time to reveal Senora Fristensky's lie. Let's take a look. Okay, can you figure out which one is the lie? Believe it or not, the only one that I have not done, I am not a runner. I ride my bike and I ride over 40 miles. Thank you. Have a great day. You heard it. Senor Fristensky isn't a runner. Did you guess it right? Thanks to Senor Fristensky for taking part in Fun Friday. And that's the Hawk Talk for today. I'm Danny Moore. And I'm Dean Carfora. Have, Have a, a great, great weekend, weekend Cold Spring, Spring Harbor. Harbor.